Welcome to A Bill a Minute from GovTrack, your 60-second breakdown of interesting bills in Congress. I'm Jesse Rifkin. The New York Times has embarked on a long-term journalism endeavor called the 1619 Project. Named after the year that slaves first arrived in the colonies, it seeks to reframe the genesis of the United States as inseparable from the development of slavery, and seeks to uh, centralize black citizens and their contributions in U.S. history. The project has also been developed into a school curriculum that's been adopted in many cities. The day before the presidential election, President Donald Trump issued an executive order creating the 1776 Commission. Named as a deliberate contrast to the 1619 Project, the 18-member group was assigned to issue recommendations for how American education could teach a more optimistic and positive view of U.S. history. On his first day in office, though, President Joe Biden issued an executive order rescinding the commission. So a new bill in Congress would recreate the 1776 commission once again. It was introduced in the House by North Carolina Republican Representative Ted Budd. Now, the bill's supporters argue that while slavery was certainly evil and should absolutely be taught, the 1619 Project swings too far in the opposite direction by promulgating an overly negative view of U.S. history to the point of self-flagellation. They say that actually the country's bedrock institutions, such as freedom of speech, freedom of the press, and a process for enacting constitutional amendments, resulted in increasing equality and decreasing racism over the course of the nation's history. But opponents say that the 1619 Project offers a more accurate and nuanced perspective of U.S. history rather than the airbrushed and overly patriotic view that the 1776 Commission would recommend. Well, look, we have the 1619 Project, the 1776 Commission. I, I can't keep all these years straight. It just proves that hindsight is 2020. Now, on, on second thought, that joke probably would have worked better last year.